So it's been just over a week since my surgery and I'm still so pleased. The only annoying thing is that my boobs are really itchy, which is obviously just while they're healing and stuff, but wow, it's irritating. So guys, if you are in need of some business tips, I suggest you follow Adam Deering. Now, he's literally the business don and he's helped me so much. So yeah, drop him a follow and send him a message. Insta stories, and I can take a guess who's the roughest. So I'm gonna go with mm, Caitlin. I'm gonna say she's rough this morning. Um, I'm gonna say Holly Jardy Shaw is rough this morning. It annoys me that when I'm having fun, we're losing you and <laughs> Hi guys, so I just thought I'd give you a little boob update, it seems I haven't spoke about it in a while, I've just been so busy, um, but I'm actually having a check up tonight with Mr Hassan, and yeah, everything's looking great at the minute, um, recovery, recovery has been itchy, like, I can't even explain this itch, like, sometimes I'm waking up at six o'clock in the morning because it's just so itchy, but obviously it means that it's healing and everything's going fine, and yeah, it's just fucking annoying though. Now, obviously, I've had an uplift, which means that it's a bit more complicated than just your regular boob job. Um, you do have to be so careful, and I did have to go on another course of antibiotics just to be on the safe side. Um, it's really important to have that, like, open contact with your surgeon. So, yeah, most of us will end up getting our surgeries in a completely different city to where we actually live. So, it's important to have that communication with your surgeon and also let your GP know. So, if there is any problems, you can just pop and see them. So yeah, I wouldn't say that my recovery has been a walk in the park by any means. It has been itchy, it's been annoying, it's been sore, it's been tender, which are all normal. And yeah, I just want people to know that it's not, it's not so.